Hello, I am Yelena and I am back to my project. Well, I still have to make a hole at the top and I have to cut this dowel in order to fit it right here and then put one over there. Because there's so much dust flying around when you're working with this attachment, I would suggest for you to cover your nose. The last piece of dowel. Let's do it. And just to make sure that my stall bars have a uniform look, I do want these pieces to be seen too. So I'm going to get this out and I'm going to make cuts here and then to send them. All the dowels are in. They look awesome. Here, a little piece is missing. So I'm going to glue this piece in. Of course, I could use a brush to spread it or I can use any piece of paper. Okay, so I'm gonna do it right underneath the plate. And I will remove all the extra glue. So now I'm going to drill holes in these dowels in order to screw them in to the wood. Even though the screw doesn't require pre-drilling, I'm afraid that these dowels might break right in the middle. I drilled holes in all the dowels and uh, now I'm going to Put the screws in. I'm using three and a quarter inch interior screws. And so I'm going to put this in in all of the ten dowels and um, uh, the project is almost done. I'm so excited. I use these plates in order to give it, um, I guess, um, just an aesthetic addition to it and just to make sure that these dowels are fixed in very well. And I'm not measuring it this time around, I'm just kind of eyeballing it. I don't know why, but I do like hardware, so I really like these uh, caps and these screws. And uh, I'm going to see how it's going to look with the uh, paint on it but hopefully at, at least it's going to look nicely uniform.